Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see from the title, this is gonna be a boohoo haul. You guys asked, so I delivered. So, let's go ahead and get right into it. <sighs> Let me start out by saying, um, <laughs> In regards to Boohoo, I have shopped them before. Um, I've shopped them twice, never for a lot of items. The first time I shopped with Boohoo, um, around Christmas time, about two years ago, I got myself two sweaters and I got my boyfriend like a, a jacket, like a bomber, but it was like a sweater material. And it was like this pretty burnt rust color. The sweater was like, cropped on me when it was supposed to be at my hips, um, which led me to believe that the one that I got from my boyfriend was gonna be horrific because it was part of his Christmas gift. He is 6'8", but the sweater was advertised as being extra, extra, what is it? XTL, or it's, a, it's an abbreviation that they have next to clothes when it's for tall people. Please understand that when he tried it on, it was a crop top it didn't even hit like at the top of his pants where it could still be like doable it was like cropped it was cute though low key i was like you know what why don't you get that back to me because i can actually wear that little oversized crop sweater so i say that to say i was, I was never wowed by the items that i got from boohoo so when you guys asked me to do boohoo haul i'm like okay i'm gonna do it so let's start with the sizing um, because they are a UK brand, their sizing is different from the United States sizing if that is where you are. I will insert a clip of their sizing chart. Um, with that being said, Boohoo on their sizing chart goes up higher than what the clothes are on the website. I cannot find anything beyond what would be a US 22. Now I am comfortable with a US 24, that is my size, so essentially all of these clothes are a size smaller than what I normally would have gotten them. And I'm saying that just so that you know, um, anything that is ill-fitting in your opinion, um, or in my opinion, a lot of it could be due to the fact that one size up probably could have made it better. Um, I'm gonna start with the fail, okay? This was like so freaking cute. I knew it probably wasn't gonna work because one, it was a whole size smaller and it had no stretch. But it was this, ooh. Y'all, that scared the crap out of me. That's actually my alarm to film, so we're ahead of schedule. Um, so this is so freaking cute. It's a short romper, okay? And it has a belt. It has these little lemons and polka dots on it. Now this thing is sheer, okay? It is sheer. It will show any and everything. Like I said, it has no stretch. So, as you can see, Julie, it will pull up and it came on. It was a little bit too tight for me um, in the stomach area. The stomach area, it was a little bit too tight. The length, I was okay with. Um, I could put it all the way on, but you're talking about that jumpsuit going to places that no jumpsuit should go. And I was not willing to do that for you guys. I just wasn't willing to do it. So, I left one arm out. But, let me say, even if this had been one size bigger, it would have not been comfortable. I think my torso is just too long for it. Um, which is a, it's a thing with my body. If Even though I'm short, like I said in another video, majority of my height is in my torso. So, um, and the majority of this outfit is torso. So it just, it just didn't work. Now, if it hadn't have been as tight in the arms, I could have finagled it. I could have, um, because I love the pattern, I could have cut right above this little stretchy part that hugs the waist and had a two piece. Yes, I will do that. I, I have no I have no shame in my game. 
but it just wasn't worth doing that considering the shorts were kind of ill-fitting the arms were kind of tight so yeah this is an absolute fail but guess what it's not that big of a fail because this will be going on Poshmark soon I have a humongous Poshmark closet that is going to be coming to you okay so you can be on the lookout for your girl here onwards and upwards so um the next item that I want to show you guys is this really cute skirt now this skirt the material of it is really thick I'm trying to see if I can get you to see it I don't it's not scuba. It's not as thick as scuba and it's stretchier than scuba, but it's of that type. Um, it's called the, oh, well, it's called the Plus Scuba Ruffle Max Skirt, so I guess it is scuba material. But yeah, it's really, really cute. Um, it gives me salsa vibes. This skirt does come in, I believe, two colors. I think it comes in like a pink and then this color. Um, yeah, but I don't know where I'm gonna wear it. It's really long on me again because I'm short. Um, I think with heels though, it would be okay, heels or wedges. But I'm excited to wear it, and I paired it with the top that I got from Red Dolls. I freaking love that top. Um, the only thing about it is, and I will I will link it below because it's still in stock and it's actually a two piece set. Um, because I thought that that part that ties was actually like adjustable. So I got it in a 4X thinking like, okay, I'll be able to really tie it and cover all of my boobs up. But that part is full, it's full. Is that how you say it? Full. It's full and it's already tied. And even if you untie it, it's still a piece of shirt there. So um, as a result, the straps fall down and they're, they're not adjustable. It's just no way for me to really make the shirt work like that. But I thought it would be cute because it had salsa vibes to, you know, pair it with that. Okay, and then, um, I love bralettes. Oh, I love bralettes. That's just me, you know? Um, and I saw that they had like sports bra bralettes available. So I was like, you know what? Let me give them a try. So I kept that same skirt on and I just tried um, these little now the straps are pretty thin. As you can see, I didn't have it adjusted much. I could have definitely tightened it and had more support. Um, and it's it's really cute the way that it's cut, you know? And um, surprisingly, it's a pretty thick material. This band is super thick. It is everything. Love the band on this. I also got it in a gray color. As you can see from the gray one, the um, to me, the gray one um, was a little bit shorter. A little bit shorter. I don't know if maybe I got them in a different size. Okay, this is, in a, this is a 24, which we know is a 22. Boo-hoo. Yeah, no, they're the same size. Yeah, but for some reason to me, the gray one seemed like it was a little bit shorter. But yeah, I love those. I'm happy I got them. If they come in other colors, I would probably end up getting them all. Just to keep it cute. All right. Next on the list, I wore these two items together, but I will talk about them separately. It was this right here. Oh, I saw it and I was like, please work. Please, 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 please work. And it did. It is super cute. Um, it is a little short but not short where I would be uncomfortable. Um, it gives the illusion of being shorter than what it is if your butt kind of sticks out. The bigger the butt, the shorter it's gonna look because of the style of uh, like dress that it is. Um, I have mine pulled up pretty high because that's in, where my natural waist is. Like I said, long torso, that's my natural waist. So um, yeah, the straps are super long. So if you are tall, this is really good for you because you can pull it down farther. So I do like that the straps are this long and them falling off a little bit occasionally is not that big of a deal to me. Um, still, still a very good, good item. I'm happy I got this. Okay, then um, I wanted to try out a bodysuit from um, Boohoo. I went and I got this white one. 
and it does snap close. It does snap close, I will say that. But it just did, I did not like it snapped close. I mean, I just come to the conclusion, I'm not really a bodysuit girl like that. Um, I have that one from that Shein haul, but I don't like it when the when the crotch snaps. Um, I actually prefer it when the snap is already closed, which they showed that it was the kind that snaps. Um, I actually think I like the bodysuit from Shein better. I think that it was, um, as far as going, stretching all the way down and being more comfortable and wearing it all day. I think that one is more comfortable. This one's really cute though, really sturdy, really thick material. Um, I think it looks really cute with the outfit I paired it with because you wouldn't need to even snap it if you didn't want to. Um, it does, it is cut really high. So if you were to wear it with like jeans or anything, it could potentially show a little bit of the dip on the side. But I mean, most of us don't care about that. Okay, and then on to the next item. I actually did not purchase this item in this particular haul. Um, the reason why I included it is because it is still available. Not only is it still available, it's really cute. The only thing about this dress, okay, really cute, thick material. It's actually pretty sturdy, considering it comes from Boohoo, um, and it's a lower price point. These buttons are faux. They don't actually unbutton, but they are on there really secure. It's really short. I'm 5'4", so imagine anybody taller than me is gonna be almost too short to wear as a dress. I mean, just depending on what your weekends look like. But I mean, I typically wear it around the house, um, if I'm just like, you know, you know, straightening up, cleaning up, chilling, it's very comfortable for that. But it is borderline almost too short on me and, you know, some would consider me short. I consider myself average height, but we won't go there. Um, but yeah, I wanted to show you guys that because like I said, it is still available and it is really cute. To me, it's very flattering. Um, and you have the option of doing what I just did in the next clip, which is pairing it with a kimono. So this kimono here, I saw it online. I was like, hmm, that's different. That's giving me fall vibes. It is really thin though, guys. It is paper, paper thin. Um, I loved it. It does not close on me again. This is a 22 by US, but as you can see in the video of me trying to close it, even if it was one size bigger, it would not have closed. Some of these are designed that way. They're not designed necessarily to close or designed to be left a little bit open with a little bit of gape, and I'm fine with that. What I was not okay with was the tightness in the arms. It almost fit, but I don't know if you guys can see or if it'll translate on camera. This is cut wrong. It's like a defect in how this is cut. The shoulder portion is over to the chest portion. So it makes it kind of fit weird in this area. Um, I do have bigger arms. So if you are plus size or even if you are straight size and you don't have bigger arms, then you're perfectly fine. But if you're lucky to not have that problem, this kimono is for you. But it will not be on Poshmark because I think I can, I know who I can give this to who will be able to fit it and it'll be cute on them. Now, the next one broke my heart, y'all. I knew more than likely that it may not fit my arms, but I just wanted it so bad. Oh, This one was so cute to me. I was like, it can double as being a cover-up um, when you go swimming or at the beach, you know? But the bad thing is, is that it just, it the arms, It you know what it gave me vibes of? Is it the movie Black Sheep? Fat guy in little coat. That's that's what we had going on there. I was the fat guy in little coat. Fat guy in little coat. Fat guy in little coat. So it it was just too ugh. like I felt like if somebody made me mad, I could be like ah and just like Hulk out of it. Okay. So yeah, no. But just so you know, in case I said like again, you have smaller arms. I love this. So if you're shorter, you can pull it up. You don't have to worry about it hanging down all low. Um, it's really thin, but it's it's pretty good quality. Um, all of the belts fit, which was kind of weird um, for them not to close all the way, but for the belts to fit. 
Okay, and then the last item I wanna show you, I got tons of questions about from the Shein haul, and it was this bad boy right here. This guy, this guy. I am showing you this guy because this guy is still available on the website. And if I am not mistaken, it is on sale. And it comes in three colors. It comes in black with this like Gucci trim. It comes in red with this Gucci trim. And then you have the white. I recommend buying it. It is the most comfortable longest cutest sweater and it comes in both straight size and plus size you heard me girls everybody can join the fun i recommend grabbing it picking it up i won't mind we can be twinsies i don't care i don't care about stuff like that you guys can purchase every single thing in this haul if you do send me pictures let me know i want to see how you styled it but yes i am including this because i got so many comments about it so yes it is still available when i purchased my items i almost got the black one because i was like some of y'all gonna buy this sweater up. <laughs> but I didn't get the black one. So I was like, uh, I'll take just having one. I did like majority of the items. The two, the, the things that were like, um, that didn't fit me properly are super cute. So if you have a smaller stomach, smaller arms, definitely recommend picking them up. Okay guys, so that is all that I have for you. Um, make sure to comment down below. Tell me what you like, what you didn't like. Tell me if there's something else that you would like me to order from or if you want me to try Boohoo again. Um, like I said, some of those items I knew they didn't have stretch and that they may not work, but I could potentially navigate the site and um, get more items. Um, if I can shop at Express who goes up to an extra large, I can definitely shop at Boohoo who goes up to a 22. So um, like I said, that's all I have for you guys today. And I love you, I mean it, bye. Subscribe. <laughs>